Hey you, are you about to join this amazing server called Alidinus? Make sure to log in and you will get a referral box. Click on the referral box. Choose I found Alidinus on YouTube. Type my name which is Uncle Naps. And this will give you 1k in blood money, 50 more cash, you will get $5 in mystery box and $15 in mystery box. And you can get some really juicy items from these boxes. Hey yo, what is good everyone? It is your boy Uncle Naps and welcome back to another banger with on Elidinus. This time guys, we have a first commenter winner. So the first commenter winner is walking away with a $15 mystery box just like that. So congrats to you. For the main giveaway guys, we are allowed to give away a juicy $50 bond to one lucky winner. All you have to do to enter this juicy giveaway, make sure to like this video, be subscribed to my YouTube channel, turn on your post notifications, and comment your in-game name down below in the comment section. With that being said, let's get straight to this video guys. Thanks for watching, take care and peace out. Alidinus has just launched a crazy update which is the Christmas Quest Winter Event as you guys can see the home is looking very juicy at the moment and let's actually get to that one uh, together so let's hop on the forums right now. So currently we are on the website forums of Alidinus guys and they have launched a crazy update but the main one for us today in this video is going to be the Xmas Quest guys and the Winter Event. Before we go to the explanation of this quest and this event guys, make sure to keep one thing in your mind because you must finish the Christmas quest to get started with the winter event guys. And as you guys can see on the um, on the forums, everything is pretty much explained. So you guys can literally like, go through it uh, yourself, like you can click on this video right over here. And this will actually explain you guys um, how to complete the quest and look at also this juicy uh, winter event like the winter shot store guys also the winter event is a very good explained um, so all you have to do is literally like go on it uh, read it and you can actually get started so we will be starting the um, Xmas, Quent, uh, Xmas quest guys actually right now and uh, yeah you can just read this update I will probably put the link in my description as well guys so let's get on to it all right, so this is going to be my first time that I will be doing this uh, quest. Also, by accident on my previous record, I screwed up. Uh, I forgot to change my screen. So as you guys can see, I've already started the quest after the book, but it's actually very easy. Uh, I will also follow the guide, which is on the forums uh, on the website of Elidinus. So you have to go to Jack Frost. Uh, whenever you uh, speak to him, he will actually hand over you the book. It will ask. He will ask. Uh, ask you as well if you want to accept the quest yes or no so i have accepted the quest and we just got this uh, christmas book uh, whenever we click on the book it actually tells you what you have to do so my first task is i should find elf hermit at the relica hunter area so let's go and find him and as well guys every step is on the forms and i will be like i said the link is the link will be in my description so make it easy for yourself and i also got some food with me some potions don't ask me why because i don't know what to expect so we have to be careful so the guide says that um, well how to go to the elf hermit we have to go to the rock crabs and we have to run south and jump uh, by clicking on the broken fence i think the broken fence is right over here so let's jump on this and as well on the second guide uh, it's telling us that we have to run northeast of the rock crabs uh, through this path and um, let's see how we get there i think we have to run this way if i'm correct uh, uh um yes so oh wait what's this oh uh, this is tunnel all right so if i look at the guide again um we are basically at the spot where we have to be ah okay so we had to run through that path um so i literally run all the way to the end of this path and right there we have the elf hermit so let's see jack frost sent me to talk to you all right let's see what we have to do help yeah of course i'm gonna help you um all right okay so we got the spade actually okay crazy so our very next step is going to be that it said that the auntie santa has hidden some of the presents under the four graves at the mausoleum uh hermit will hand over a spade you need to dig a person at the mausoleum together either run from cannabis or run from slayer tower click the portal to get teleported to the other side and now we have to right click dig search all the graves to spawn the zombie kill them to loot for presents we 
All right, guys. So what we're gonna do is we are um, gonna teleport and uh, or like either way through Caliphus or Slayer Tower, and uh, yeah, let's actually start the journey from here as well. All right, right now we are at the Slayer Tower. Um, I will be trying to run from Slayer Tower um, to this place with a pretty odd name like Mausoleum, something like that. Uh, let's see if we are going good. Alright, I think it's pretty much this way. Oh look, there's a picture of a present. Yeah, there's a portal. Oh, let's go guys, we found it. Of course, thanks to uh, Osiris uh, wiki map that helped me out. Uh, let's see. Okay, so what we have to do now is uh, we have to dig search all graves to spawn the zombie Zombies actually to kill them uh, To loot the full presence. All right, let's see. Uh, oh, we have to dig uh, Let's see what's gonna happen now. Okay, there is so basically this is the summon zombie The first holy shit a 50 just like that. Okay, we got the first present. I think we have to dig all four Okay, this is the second one. Come on, smash him. The third one. There's the... We have another present right over here. Let's make some space. A juicy 50 just like that. And this is... Oh, no, 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 wait. Oh, wait. Oh, yeah, I have to search it. Never mind. But that's crazy. The first one, it says dick. And this one was like search. And just like that, we have received another present the black one okay so the very next step is going to be like it says once you've looted other four presents you have to go back to Raleka event uh area and speak to elf hermit turn the present in and we'll give you another item okay let's do that guys so we have to go back to hermit all right so right now we are at hermit again the elf hermit let's see um yep i gave him the presents um let's see oh he said i'm missing something what Wait, what's going on? Oh, wait, I got a head crystal. Let's look at it. Nothing interesting happening. All right, let's see. Um, So we have to go back to the mausoleum to find the anti Santa. Right click on the grave, search. Anti Santa will appear to use. Okay, so we have to use the heart crystal on the anti Santa. Uh, let me see. And he will summon Krampus. You must kill the NPC to get the last present. So we have to go back to the uh, to the spot named. What's it called again? Mausoleum? Something like that. All right, so we are back um, at Masodium. Um, okay, so let's see. It says right click on the grave and search. All right, let's search this. Okay, there's the Auntie Santa. We have to use this on this bad boy. What's happening? Oh, here's Krampus. Okay, so we have to attack Krampus. We also changed my gear. Holy shit, this mage gear is hella strong. Holy macaroni. Yeah, so I have like, I think this is the best in slot, guys. So. This is very OP. Um, let me see. You must kill the NPC for the last present. Okay, so we got the last present. Let's see. So we have to return the last present to Elf Hermit, then teleport to home and talk to Frost Jack to complete the quest. Oh, this is actually sick. So basically, we are getting very close at completing uh, this juicy uh, quest. So right now, what we are going to do, guys, we have to go back to Elf Hermit, uh, which is through the rock crabs. So we're getting closer to Elf Hermit and let's hand over the last present. Uh, you received the final present. You can tell Jack for that you were very helpful. All right, let's go back home. All right, so currently we are running towards Jack. Um, Jack Frost, let's talk to him. Let's see what he's gonna say. Um, you have to receive our present, that's correct, Elf Hermit. Uh, thank you very much, Uncle Nav. Thank you, blah, blah, blah. So much were banked instead. Oh, holy shit. Anyways, guys, we have completed this amazing quest. So I'm awarded with 10k winter shots, golden snowball, icy jumper, snow globe helmet, and frost skimitar, which is the T1. So I have learned the ability to damage winter foes. So we also have now access to this juicy winter shot store, guys. Jack Frost, right click. Look at this guy's winter shop rewards. Look at all of these juicy items. Oh no, so this is going to be a very cool, cool grind to get some really juicy stuff out of this shop, guys. Since we completed the Xmas quest, means that we have access to the winter event right now, guys. And guess what? 
So also at the guides on the farms guys I have to grab a skimita T1 which is right over here and um, so I can just like to kill the NPCs um, I can kill one, up to 150 NPCs in the winter zone every 24 hours guys uh, and this axis well of course this area is like south of edge bank wall which is right over here uh, next to the restore pool which is actually over here guys and like also the greater teleport focus so clicking on this portal we have two options winter boss area and winter zone so the winter zone is actually looking like this uh, i haven't uh, killed any npc yet so let's just kill one bad boy uh, let's see what we're gonna receive also what's really cool about this zone guys is so basically worldwide there are npc spawned uh, roaming but unlike the h1 event they will have to be scattered and not clumped up so there is a one up to 100 chance to spawn a superior winter monster with a better drop table it's ice demons only guys so we have received some winter shots from our first skill and um let's see so basically you can also spend winter shots to upgrade your frost scream uh skimita up to tier 3 guys and well you guys already know where the shop is and you can also buy a frost shield and upgrade it to become a frost shield b guys so our very next step is going to be we are going to check out the winter boss area so the winter boss area is as followed guys at this area right over here the snowflake boss so which is actually the winter boss spawns every two hours and has the following mechanics snowflake attacks with magic and ranged every 10 attacks he does a aoe attack getting caught will deal one up to 50 damage and you will be frozen for five seconds when snowflake hits 50 percent of its health he will throw snowballs and where the snowballs land will snow. You have to make snowballs from the snow globe spawning inside the area. Then continue killing the boss with snowballs for the remaining of its health. Auto weapons will always be blocked. So there are also winter bottles. Winter bottles are obtainable from boss drops 1 up to 100 kills. Raids 1 up to 10. Slayer 1 up to 25. Also task system works the same as the bottles already in game completing a winter task will grant you 10,000 winter shots and there's also a shards exchange guys you can spend your winter shots on the winter chest at the area event which is right over here let's look for that bad boy uh, uh, uh um, where's the chest 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 hello okay so the chest is right over here guys so actually oh let's see they're not unlike the member rewards are you sure you want yeah let's just proceed Okay, so guys, right, you guys, as you guys can see, there's a winter event uh, exchange right over here. So it costs 10k shards for each roll. When you un unlocked all rewards, you can reset the chest and go again. So let's actually try one and see what we're gonna receive, guys. So we got ourselves a $5 mystery box. Let's open this bad boy up. And this gave me 1k anglerfish. Well, very useful for P PK and stuff. You can also purchase a winter ticket on the website for $50 and get better rewards, guys. Also, guys, there is a final reward will be a winter chest containing, guys, which is the winter Tebow, the winter scythe, and the winter Tumekans. So this was the Xmas slash the winter event, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this one. Make sure to join Alidinus today, guys. It's, it's such an amazing server. It's currently peaking over 100 players, I guess. Yeah, look at that, 128 players, guys. Uh, obviously there's an afk zone but that does not make that this service inactive it's actually pretty active in my opinion people are just grinding right now so also guys make sure to refer on my name uh that that will give you a really so like really cool items some really good goodies as well so come join now and you know maybe you will be start starting rich actually if you got some lucky with the boxes anyways guys for that being said thanks for watching take care and peace out are you